Good morning. This is the KSL Fastcast for Thursday, August 29th. I'm Cher Park. Here are the local headlines. The self-proclaimed landlords for Park City Mountain Ski Resort say their tenant has until Monday to move off most of the land where the resort operates. The Talisker Land Holdings Company says it's terminating its agreement with the resort. This is just the latest development in a months long dispute between the two companies over the land. Talisker claims the resort lease expired on April 30th of 2011. A property dispute in Spanish Fork ended with a hit and run accident. Now one woman is in the hospital and another may face charges. Police say on Tuesday as 53 year old Diana Carlson was about to drive off in her truck. The 43 year old victim put her arm in a window that was partially rolled down attempting to stop the woman from fleeing. The victim was dragged a short distance before her arm became dislodged and she fell. A trailer attached to the truck then ran over her head. A Utah County mom is fighting to help her 11 year old son get relief from a debilitating illness, and she says the solution for her son could be found in a medical marijuana. Doctors say an extract from the plant has shown it can help treat the rare form of seizures that her son suffers from, but all forms of marijuana are illegal in Utah. Now this next story is just too funny. I have to share it. An Oregon teen called 911 during the middle of a standoff with a spider. The girl was home alone when she spotted the eight legged intruder before police arrived. She told dispatchers it was similar to a tarantula and she was too afraid to trap or kill it. Listen to her 911 call. I have no idea what to do and I can't get hold of my parents. So I don't know if you guys have anything I can do or if I just sit here and stare at it and wait for somebody at home to kill it. Yeah, that just happened. Well, you can be relieved to know that the cops did show up and they were able to get rid of the spider with a rolled up newspaper and everyone lived happily ever, ever after, except for, of course, the spider. Now here's a look at today's fast cast forecast. Salt Lake high of 95, Ogden 92, Provo 93, and St. George still pretty high at 98. Going to be a hot one. That's it for this fast cast on this Thursday. Have a great day and of course go Utes and Aggies as they start their season tonight.